Larry Atensi with CNTV, and today we're at World Famous Water World in Denver, Colorado. America's biggest, America's best. We actually caught up with them here on a great happening day. We've got a uh, belly flop contest that just happened throughout here. I am here with Joanne Cortez. Let me ask you, Joanne, tell me what happened today. Well, thanks for being here. You were here on a good day. Yes. It was the 15th annual belly flop contest, and this year it was a competition between colleges. So we had representatives from technical colleges, of course, CU, UNC, Metro State, woohoo, go Metro, and of all the other local colleges. It was fantastic. And we had a female winner and a male winner, and they won some scholarship money. Wonderful. I mean, Waterworld is a fantastic place to come, not only in the summertime, but as soon as that sun comes out here in Colorado. You guys have 46 attractions out here, but it didn't start that way. How long have they been serving the Denver area here? We opened Waterworld in 1979. And since then, we've been growing. We do have 46 attractions on 67 acres, um, everything from Lazy River to the body slides that'll take you down a 72% grade at about 24 miles per hour. It's, it's pretty intense. We've got something for everyone, the mile to the wild. <laughs> and I'm here with the uh, lead lifeguard, Phil. Let me ask you, Phil, all the kids out here and the adults as well come to fun time, but it's guys like you that make sure that it's a safe environment. Tell me what you guys do here to make sure everything's fine. We have guards basically everywhere and anywhere you look. Every ride, we have somebody at the bottom. Every ride, we have somebody at the top. And then all of our deep pools, uh, we have at least six guards around each area just to ensure that no little kids get away from their parents and everybody's having a safe and fun time because that's, that's what we're here to promote, making sure that everybody leaves that came in. Well, that sounds great. Do some of the rides, do they have a height requirement or are they all pretty much good? We do have various requirements. Some of our rides require a 42-inch height limit and then some of them also require a 48-inch. But we do have a number of family rides that are big tube rides that infants and babies can go with their families and that's no problem at all. So every ride will have it listed and our lifeguards can tell everybody you're just a ride about or hey, maybe next year. But we do have a number of rides for all the little kids and we have little play structures all around as well so nobody is left behind. And so what I like about a place like this is it looks like everybody's having a fantastic time but you know what there's guys like you that are sharp all the time making sure your eyes are watching everything. Yeah, I mean it's one of the best jobs to have. When you're here you got to be on your game because our most important thing is the customers. We want to make sure everybody's safe and having a good time first but our top priority is to make sure everybody's safe. Top priority there folks you heard it straight from Phil the lead guard here. They're on top of their game so basically you can have a safe wonderful day here at Waterworld. Let me ask you this, as far as when they come in the front gates right out there, first of all, the parking out there is free parking, which is kind of a rarity anymore when you're talking about amusement park. It is, absolutely. And a lot of people don't realize that we are community-owned and operated. And what makes that beneficial to our guests is that, you know, we want families to come out and have fun and really enjoy the fruits of their contribution as well. So we have free parking, picnics are welcome. We just ask people to no alcohol and no glass. But other than that, bring in what you like and enjoy, have a full day with your family. So they walk through the front gates there. Let me ask you, first of all, what kind of ages are we talking about that you can accommodate? Oh, my goodness. It's everything. It's from the brand new babies in Wally World. They have a blast. We've got these mini fountains where parents can actually ride with their children down. We've got this area right behind us where you see babies, um, but it's all the way up to about nine years old. It's called Calypso Cove. And a couple of years ago, we introduced the Big Top Family Fun Zone, which is down by Turbo Racer. That is a very unique circus-themed area. It's just a wonderful area for families. Waterworld is a great place for all the little kids around here. Let me ask you guys, why do you guys like Waterworld? It has lots of fun rides. Do you, how often do you guys come out here? Um, maybe like once, twice a week. Oh my gosh, you guys love it out here. You guys do all kinds of stuff. Do you ride the rides too? Yeah. yeah. 
I went on that slide that goes. The slide that goes back and forth. Uh, I mean, you, wow, you're you're pretty brave, huh? What do you like riding when you come out? I like to ride all the slides. All the slides too. Yeah. And today's a perfect day because it's hot out. Really hot. Thanks for bringing us, Mom. And then when you get into that teenage years and you get a little more creative and daring, tell me what kind of ride you got for them. Well, you know, that's actually one of the benefits of Big Top as well. It's adjacent to three of the highest, fastest slides in North America. We're talking flat line, red line, and pipeline. And those are some awesome body slides. It's also adjacent to Turbo Racer, which is an eight-lane, belly-down racer. So you can race your friends, your family. And so there are some challenging rides next to the more family-friendly area. All right, ladies, it looks like a great day for Waterworld. Let me ask you guys, what part of Denver you come from? I'm from Thornton. Thornton, and I'm Broomfield. How often do you guys get out here to Waterworld to have fun? Two, three times a month. My goodness, two, three times a month. And when you guys come out with friends, what's the most popular ride you love? I like Voyage to the Center of the Earth. It's a good ride. It takes a long time. It's fun. We did the inside or something like that. It's new. It's cool. Are you guys more of the daring type, or do you guys like more of the amusement type ride? Oh, we're definitely the daring type. Oh, yeah. Yeah, we'll try anything. So what is, what is the most daring ride here, you would say? I'd have to say maybe lines. They're pretty tall. There's three of them. They go straight down. A lot of kids get up there, chicken out, and have to walk back down, but not us. And let me ask you, somebody who hasn't been out to Waterworld before, what would you basically tell them? Um, I tell them it's a really good day to spend with your family. There's a lot of cool stuff to do, a lot of areas of park for all different ages. The wave pools are all great. You'll have a good time no matter what you do. Also throughout the park, we have the largest pool that you'll ever find in the Rocky Mountain region. It's called Thunder Bay. It's 1.8 million gallons of water and ocean-like waves. And we also have the wave, which is a surfing attraction. And I'm told that those waves are just as good as what you might find to surf in in Hawaii or Mexico. Pretty rare, I imagine, a side-by-side -side wave deal like that. Everything we've done here at Waterworld is unique. We've taken standard attractions and themed them to make them really exciting. And so we think it's something that the entire community can be proud of. Uh, we are also very well revered in the international water park community. We've been rated in the top ten and in some cases even the top five water parks in the world by the Travel Channel. So we're proud of that and that's a recognition that we love to share with our residents and guests. Wonderful. And what's nice, you can spend the whole entire day here, but let's say you don't bring your food with you. You guys got that taken care of as well as far as your restaurant. We absolutely do. We have quality food at a good price because, once again, we're community-owned and operated. We're not out to gouge anybody. All the money that's made here at Waterworld stays in the community for programs like football, basketball, gymnastics for our residents in this area. What are some of the food they can chomp on while they come on in? You know, at Waterworld, you're going to get all sorts of quality food choices. Uh, we are community-owned and operated, so the prices are real, real reasonable. Uh, but you can get anything, like what's a beach funnel cakes, wonderful ice cream, the best hot dogs around, grilled chicken, and, you know, anything you can expect at a beach, we have. It's really a good choice, too. All right, we got some ladies out here from Broomfield, very close by. They come down here to Waterworld. Let me ask you guys, so what do you come to Waterworld for? Why is it so fun? Because of the slide. Let me ask you, what's your favorite ride? Oh my gosh, I could not pick. I would probably have to say the white slide. I love that pit in your stomach you get. What about the rides that you go into and they get dark and they have music and all? Are they pretty cool? Yeah, those are fun. Those are fun. Yeah. Cool. I like the white slides. I like the droppy feeling in your stomach. I don't know, I just like it. You guys can go on that over and over and over. It never gets tiring, huh? Wow. Uh, when you guys come out here with your friends, how many friends do you the deal? Um, yeah, we have like 10 or 11 or so. But what would you tell kids out there that haven't been here before? I would say to definitely come here because it's just a place where you can hang out with your friends and have a blast. So we're talking about fun here, guys. Uh, these are the girls from Broomfield. They're down here having a great day.
invest thousands of dollars every year in our flower program. So just to take a stroll through Waterworld, you'll be amazed at the flowers and that you'll be taken aback by the beautiful color arrangements that we have. As an example, one of our new attractions is Pirate's Plunge, which is a remake of the old Bermuda Triangle, one of our classics. It wouldn't be complete without beautiful floral theming. So we have an award-winning landscaper who takes care of all of our flower uh, offerings, and they are gorgeous. So people of all ages can enjoy that. We're the leader in the world of family attractions. So we are the innovator of the large family tube ride. Bring your family and experience the rides together. You can basically find yourself a little cabana over and enjoy the day as well. Tell me about that. Uh, the cabanas are a new addition to Waterworld, and they've been a huge hit. I think we've got several dozen of them right now, and they're very, very sought after. It's a good deal, and it's a great way to sort of have a little piece of privacy for you and your family. And so, folks, you come on in here. Uh, this is all ages, as you can see. It's a family environment out here. It's really nice because you can actually rent yourself a locker as well, and so you have all your stuff there, and you can go back and pick up whatever you need and whatnot, and uh, you can come on in for the day, and, but you can also get a season pass. Tell us about your season passes. Our season passes pretty much pay for themselves in the third visit, and so that's a great investment investment for someone who's going to spend a lot of time here. We have attractions that are world-renowned, like Voyage to the Center of the Earth. It's sort of an Indiana-style attraction where we have animation, we have music, we have sound effects of all types. Uh, it's a real themed experience. That's a, a signature attraction, so we encourage people to take advantage of that, as is Lost River of the Pharaohs, which is sort of an Egyptian-themed, underground-feeling uh, type of attraction. So we've got a lot to offer. Plan to spend the whole day here. We are open from 10 to 6 daily, from Memorial Day to Labor Day. And of course, it's all weather permitting as a water park. And I think you're right because from a bird's eye view of 67 acres, this is a beautiful oasis. You look down on this and it just looks wonderful. So folks, you've got everything right there under one place here. You can come on out, bring the whole entire family. They do groups as well. If you want to go on the website, the website is at the bottom of the screen. They're happy to accommodate a lot of groups out there. Is it pretty good for the groups that can come in for that? Oh, absolutely. We have so many groups that take advantage of the great pricing. We encourage it because you're looking for something special to do during the summer. Families plan vacations, sometimes away from the area. Groups can plan to stay in the area for the day, and it really feels like you're on a vacation. I bet. I mean, folks, you can bring your food, you can bring your tubes, or you can forget your food and forget your tubes. You can rent the tubes here, you can buy the food here, you can enjoy the entire day, honestly. You put the locker and you're all set to go. Even if you get tired of walking up the mountain there with your tube, they have two valet. We do, and that's also a new feature. So for $30, it's right around there, you can actually um, get a band that will allow you to rent a tube and it takes you to a special line, takes you right to the front or tube of valet. Wonderful. They're going to treat you like royalty out here, folks. Come on out to Waterworld. They are world-renowned. They've got so many attractions. They've added to back in 79. They started out with just a couple rides, and it's evolved into Denver's most premier dedicated water park. Absolutely. I mean, Without question. Gary, and thanks for coming out. You betcha. Thank you. This is Gary Atensi with CNTV. And if you don't know, now you know. <laughs>